Hey everybody, Dr. A here, and in this video, we're gonna be exploring an example of the falling head permeability test. So let's go ahead and get started. We are being told that the following values for a falling head permeability test are given as the specimen length being eight and a half inches, the specimen cross-section area is five square inches, the standpipe cross-section area is 0.15 square inches, the duration of the uh, water collection is seven minutes. The initial head, so H1, is 27 inches, and the final head is nine inches. And if you remember, uh, these two heads are measured um, from a piezometer that's attached to the specimen. So, um, you know, for a simple question like this, uh, you really just um, obtain our... Uh, governing equation. You don't need to derive it. You can just take the pre-derived version of the equation, uh, either the natural log version or the log base 10 version. I'll go ahead and use the log base 10 version, um, but we know that hydraulic conductivity is equal to 2.303 times little a capital L over capital A T times log base 10 of H1 over H2. Now we can substitute in all of these values accordingly. So 2.303, we were directly given little a, so that's 0.15 square inches. The specimen length is 8.5 inches um, divided by the um, specimen cross-section area, which is five square inches. Uh, and then the duration was seven minutes. If you want to, you could convert that to seconds if the question is wanting you to calculate this in units of inches per second. And then we're gonna have log base 10 of 27 inches over nine inches. So we can punch this through in our calculators. So I'm gonna punch this through in my TI-36X Pro. Um, so let's go ahead and start cranking things through and we're going to have the 2.303 multiplied by 0.15 multiplied by 8.5 and we're going to divide by 5 times 7 um, and then we got the log base 10 in there so I get um, 0 0.04003 inches per minute now, uh, again, if a problem asks for it in inches per second, no problem with that. You just convert this seven minutes to uh, the equivalent in seconds. Um, you can also notice that the units work out. So if you're tracking your units, the square inches cancel here and the inside the logarithm, these two inches cancel. So you're left with inches per minute as you would expect here. So that concludes this very brief uh, example of a falling head permeability test calculation. Thanks for watching. Please hit like and subscribe.